Where are we headed? Break our back. <laughs> strawberry picking. Why did I think that one was red? I don't know. I thought it was red. We're looking at our flowers. You want to show them? Sure. Out the window. Just planted all those this morning. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> this year. Her mother had always wanted to do that, so we're going to plant this year. And this year, this beautiful. Beautiful. Zoom oh, out. <laughs> So we are going over to New Hampshire to go strawberry picking because tonight or this afternoon or this morning I'm going to make um, strawberry preserves and I'm also going to make dill pickles and Kristen is going to watch the World Cup. Oh, that's at 11 a.m. by the way. All right, we'll be back in time. We got two. Stop it! We have two hours. All right, you told me it was at three. I know. I looked it up last night. It's at 11. Oh my gosh. Well, we're probably not going to vlog the World Cup. We're just going to vlog a little bit of strawberry picking and a little bit of canning. Sound good? I mean, maybe we'll get a little bit of Kristen screaming at the television. That's always fun. There's corn. I don't think that's people corn, though. Oh, and sheeps. Sheep, 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 that's all the sheep. So we're going to pick at, what's it called? Edgewater. Edgewater Farms. They're technically located in Plainfield, New Hampshire, but their strawberry picking field is in Cornish, New Hampshire. And it's kind of a pain in the booty, see, there we go, to get out of the parking lot, but we will busy. do it. Oh, it is busy, probably because it's so cool outside. That's what I'm gonna guess. 7 to 12 and 4 to 7, they close for the hottest time of the day. Free range chickens. Buck, buck. It's not quite as far back as it was last year. They must rotate their farm, they're at fields. There's a lot of people. Sorry for the bumps. It's called living in the country. <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. I brought her own boxes. We'll show you. What we brought to fill. We got two boxes. Kristen's excited. I'm going to do the big one. She's going to do the small one as much as she can. But first, we got to go get our boxes weighed. See how much it costs this year. Hey, what's the cost this year? Or whatever she just said. Three twenty-five a pound, up to ten pounds. But when you hit ten pounds, it goes down to two fifty a pound. That's cute. Let's go. We have to go to the umbrella, and Jen will tell us where to go. But I'm not going to put Jen on video because that would be mean. I'm going to sign up. How's it going, Kristen? It's going. Some good looking berries. We apparently got the unweeded row. Fine. There's Kristen's. How's it going? How's it going? Okay. Tired? No. No, I'm not tired. How's your hip? Okay, why don't you quit? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Okay, how much did we pick? How did I end up with a small one? I don't think it was right either. There's no way this is 16 pounds. 15? Well, supposedly we picked 15.25 pounds. She also didn't take off the tear, which was 1.1. Oh well, we supported a local business, right? Yeah. I'll get it. So we're gonna weigh that again when we get home because we're not sure that's 15 pounds. But we supported the local farm, that's fine. I don't know if we'll pick next year. What do you think, Kristen? Depends on how old I feel. I think we should pick at the farm stand. And I, we were gonna go yesterday and it was 93 yesterday. I'm really glad we didn't go yesterday because it's only 66 today and I feel like death. <laughs> How about That's you? not the temperature. What's yes, the it temperature? is. 66. That's the inside temperature. The temperature right there is 66. I know. I didn't know what you were looking at. So, we're going to go home. Kristen's going to watch the World Cup. And Aaron's going to. I don't know. Make all the things. I can help. Nah. Yeah, I can because I can watch it on my iPad. I don't mind, Kristen. But just A beware lot of, of those be. pots that boil over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dropped you. I've been promoted. <laughs> promoted. Reassigned. Away from the stove. There's no stovage going on for a while. What are you doing? I'm making labels. Making labels. Taking names. The World Cup. So, so far. I've got the strawberries ready. They gotta sit for several hours. Made a bunch of dishes. I just turned my water bath on. Made the brine, but I haven't turned it on yet. I'm gonna chop some gar garlic, figure out how many cloves I need, and cut up some cucumbers, and we are going to make dill pickles. Um, and I don't know what else will happen. The well, the, obviously the strawberry preserves but that won't happen till later and I'm only making I think eight eight half pints of that I don't know depends on what I have for jars it's gonna be a long day all right the brine is cooking the canner's all warmed up the lids have been sterilized peeled the garlic have the dill cut washed and cut the cucumbers got bay leaves uh, pickle crisps Pickling spice, extra dill. Oh, this is the video I follow from the Yankee Prepper. Great, great video. Use it every time. And I'm gonna start canning, which I can't do, show you because I only have two hands. So, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, she is packing pickles. Speed packing. Pick a pack of pickled peppers. Pickled cucumbers. She is speed packing those pickles. I don't want the jars to cool. Faster, faster, oh, faster! Worry. Well, I still have to add the brine, too. Faster! Well, the brine will warm them back up. Whoops. Blind pickles. Not pickles yet. Pickles in training? Pickle wannabes. I have to do another batch. Ooh, yeah. I don't know if I have enough vinegar. Oh, bummer. Well, that's okay. I can always go to the store and get some for you. Yeah, that's good. I've been watching too much Four. soccer. Who won? U.S. won. They did? Yes, they did. Sorry for any spoilers. So, when did they play again? That was the World Cup final. Oh, so they are the World Cup champions? Yeah. It's great. Do you know how often the World Cup happens? Every four years. Yeah. I did play soccer, you know. Hmm. What is your father watching? Hmm? What is your father watching? Sounds like, um, I don't know, a pokey little puppy? I don't know who's gonna last longer. Are you stuck in the pickles or my arm holding up the camera? Me stuck in the pickles. Probably right, because my arms are getting tired. Okay. Stop, 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 stop. Shove them in there. Is that it? How are you gonna do that? Very careful. Pickle for me, another pickle for me, another pickle for me, another pickle for me. All those pickles for me. Just kidding. How many? 
I don't know how many. I told you. I wasn't Listening. listening. <laughs> 17. 17. When can you eat them? Six weeks. August 18th is pickle day. Whoop, whoop. Be on the road. Which is why we had to can so early. Whoop, whoop. Oh. Old, old. <laughs> I'm trying to avoid disaster tonight. Which is why I have the camera and not the spoon. Yeah. Because why? Oh, look on Instagram. <laughs> and a wee bit of a bubble over. Wasn't Kristen's fault. <laughs> well. Ten minutes, then we had the lemon juice. Then ten the more minutes. Juice. Yep. Gross. To cut the foam, I think. And then we can it. We've got three pints in the canner. We had four, but when I pulled the cans, the jars out of the water bath to can, um, to put the preserves in, one of them had a crack and you can barely even see it but it would have exploded in the in the pot when we um, put the pressure, you know, put the lid on and under the pressure it would have exploded and then the whole thing would have been lost. So we decided to go with three and then we took a quart jar there. And once that cools, it'll go right in the fridge. I think that's how it works. Because <laughs> uh, it's all cooked. Um, what we're doing in the water bath is just preserving, so. I'll show you everything that we made today in just a little bit. Okay, there they are. We have 16, 17 jars of pickles, one quart of preserves to go in the fridge when it cools, and then three pints of strawberry preserves. And that's all for today. Tomorrow, I may attempt some strawberry sauce, but we'll see. That's all for tonight. Thanks for watching. You wanna say goodnight, Kristen? <laughs> Good night. Good night, guys.